WordFence is one of the biggest names in WordPress security. If you're wondering whether the free version of WordFence is enough for your site or whether you should buy the premium version of WordPress, you've come to the right video. We spent over a month testing both the free and premium versions of WordPress. In this video, you'll see a feature by feature comparison between the free and premium versions, an analysis of the pricing and the best alternative to WordFence as well. Check the end of the video for a final verdict about whether WordFence premium is actually worth the cost. But first, welcome to the channel. My name is Julian and this channel will help you fix common WordPress issues and also help you improve site performance. So if you're a website owner or manager, hit that subscribe button and bell icon for weekly helpful videos from WordPress experts. All right, let's start the video. Chapter one, feature by feature comparison for WordFence free versus WordFence premium. Number one, malware scanner. When we tested WordFence's malware scanner, we threw a lot of malware at the plugin. Our test websites had a lot of file-based malware in the core files at first, which WordFence was able to detect easily. Then we added the redirect malware and Japanese keyword malware to the database and ran the scanner again. WordFence was only able to detect some of the malware. Similarly, when we tried scanning for malware in the premium themes and plugins, WordFence did not detect any of it. Overall, the malware scanner is decent, but by no means great. The malware scanner on WordFence Premium has three differences from the free version. Number one, premium scan signatures. Number two, real-time signature update. Number three, reputation checks. Let's break down each of these in turn. Number one, premium scan signatures. On the dashboard, WordFence says that the free scanner is at 60% efficiency. The premium version adds premium scan signatures and reputation checks. Therefore, theoretically, upgrading to WordFence Premium should enable malware detection in premium themes and plugins. However, in our tests, that did not happen. The upgraded scanner didn't find all the malware in premium themes and plugins, although the percentage was better than the free version. The premium scanner was still unable to detect all the database-based malware though. Number two, real-time signature updates. The premium version also promised promises to have real-time updates to malware signatures. To understand this, you need to understand the mechanism WordFence uses to detect malware. Signature matching. Signature matching compares the code on your website to a database of malware signatures. If there are matches, the code is flagged as malware. There are two problems with this system. First of all, malware is constantly evolving as hackers find more creative ways to camouflage it. Second, the WordFence team needs to have seen the malware to add it to the database. Even if they are incredibly efficient, there is no way they have seen all the code ever. Therefore, the WordFence scanner is going to miss some malware for sure. Hopefully, not on your website, but definitely somewhere. Real-time signature updates are an attempt to mitigate the effects of both of these issues. If the malware signature database gets updated more frequently, it can detect more malware. Theoretically, that being said, we came across a report that said that the free scanner gets updates 30 days after the premium scanner, which is a long time in WordPress security. Number three, reputation checks. As far as reputation checks go, this is not a significant part of WordPress security in any case. WordFence checks to see if your website is listed on the three blacklists which is something you can check easily on your own. The more important point is to make sure that the malware that probably caused your website to land on the blacklists should be addressed on priority. We'll talk more about that aspect in the malware cleaning section. Verdict. Malware detection is not significantly better on WordFence Premium when compared to WordFence Free. Premium malware signatures, real-time signature updates, and reputation checks ultimately add very little efficiency to the malware scanner because the underlying mechanism is flawed. WordFence uses signature matching to detect malware, which means that there will always be malware that will pass the scanner undetected. Number two, malware cleaner. In the case of WordFence's malware cleaner, there is no difference between the free and premium versions. During our tests, once we finished scanning the website for malware, the scan results had two options for auto-clean. Delete all deletable files and repair all repairable files. We tried both options. However, WordFence warned us that a site could break as a result of the cleaning. We had backups of our test site, so we went forward. The automated options get rid of the malware that the scanner detected without a problem. Obviously, the cleaner could not do anything about the malware that had not been detected in the first place. WordFence is right to warn people about their auto-clean options. For instance, if a plugin or theme adds custom code, it could be wrongly flagged as malware, and then the auto-clean option would delete it. That would cause some functionality on the site to break for sure. This is because of the inherently flawed nature of signature matching for malware detection that WordFence uses. Premium malware removal. The premium version of the plugin has the same auto-clean system. However, WordFence does provide a malware removal service for an additional fee to their premium subscribers. So, if you do discover malware on your website, and the free version is too worrisome to try out, then you can upgrade to the premium subscription and pay a one-time fee for malware removal. This is actually where it gets fairly steep. WordFence offers malware cleaning and blacklist removal assistance for $490 over and above the premium subscription. The cleanup is guaranteed for a year if and only if you follow their post-hack measures to the letter. That means if your site gets reinfected in less than 12 months, WordFence will not charge you again unless the reinfection is your fault. Verdict. 
Automatic malware removal on the free and premium versions of the plugin are exactly the same and do not inspire confidence. WordFence's malware removal service is over and above the premium subscription and is expensive at $490 a pop. Number three, Firewall. WordFence's firewall keeps out major threats. A web application firewall for WordPress websites means that it needs to protect the website from brute force attacks, other bad bots, SQL injection attacks, cross-site scripting attacks, and so on. The firewall prevents hackers from exploiting vulnerabilities on the website, in addition to filtering away bad traffic so it cannot overwhelm the website with bad requests. The WordFence firewall does all of these things reasonably well on both the free and premium versions of the plugin. However, there are two extra features that the premium version has. Number one, premium rules. Number two, real-time updates to the block list. When we installed the free version first, the dashboard clearly said that it is only 64% effective. Both these features would have taken the efficacy to 100%, but what do they mean? Number one, premium rules. Firewalls are filters for traffic traffic on your website, and to work, they require rules. The firewall checks the traffic for threats using these rules and only lets the good traffic pass through to the website. Since threats evolve over time, rules need to be updated to block new threats. Therefore, WordFence has made their free firewall much less effective by delaying rule updates. Number two, real-time updates to the block list. Another way a firewall protects a website is by filtering out traffic from bad IPs. It does this by maintaining a block list of IP addresses. Firewalls learn which IPs belong on the block list through global IP protection. For instance, if a website in a different part of the world experiences an attack from a particular IP, the WordFence firewall learns that this IP is bad and adds it to that website's block list. It then updates the same information on all other WordFence firewalls installed on all other websites. However, the key difference between the free and premium WordFence firewall is that the updates for the premium version occur in real time. On the other hand, the free version receives updates much later on. We were not able to find out the time delay, but it could be anything from a few days to a few weeks. In that time, your website is vulnerable to attacks from those bad IPs. Verdict. The firewall is the single significant difference between WordFence Free and WordFence Premium. Getting rules and block list updates on a time delay is scary because that leaves your site vulnerable to currently active hackers and threats. In this one case only, the premium version is definitely the better option. Number four, two-factor authentication. WordFence recently made their two-factor authentication feature free for all users. There is no difference between the free and premium versions. The feature works very well out of the box and can be configured easily to include a recapture on the login page. Verdict? No difference between the free and premium version. Number 5. Vulnerability Detection The WordFence scanner does a good job of detecting out-of-date and vulnerable plugins and themes. Any detected vulnerabilities are flagged as critical threats and should be dealt with on priority. In fact, if you're able to update vulnerable plugins and themes as they are discovered, it will go a long way in protecting your website from threats. Verdict? No difference between the free and premium versions of the plugin. Number 6. Geoblocking Geoblocking or country blocking is only available on WordFence Premium. We typically do not recommend geoblocking for security. This is for two reasons. Firstly, geoblocking uses IP ranges to block out visitors from a specific country. IPs are dynamic and keep changing. Plus, they are not always accurate. Supposing you wanted to block out visitors from a particular country, but not from a neighboring one, anyone living close to the border would have a reasonable chance of being blocked inadvertently. Secondly, geo-blocking can keep out good bots as well. Not all bots are good, but you definitely want bots like the Google bot or uptime monitoring ones to have access to your website at all times. If you do want to implement geo-blocking, WordFence makes it very easy to do so from the dashboard. Otherwise, you would need a separate plugin or you would need to modify this file to do it. Verdict? This is a premium feature only, but also can be achieved through other means. Number 7. Support WordFence Premium users get priority support, whereas few users need to find their answers in the support forum. The forum is actively maintained by the WordFence team, so free users aren't left to fend for themselves. Verdict? Priority support is a premium feature only. However, the support forum is also a decent option for free users. Number 8. Pricing If you're considering upgrading to WordFence Premium, the $99 price tag per year shouldn't be a sticking point. In fact, the more sites you add, the more economical the pricing becomes. However, after thorough testing, we have found that the price tag is essentially for a better version of the firewall, which is frankly still worth it from a security perspective. But the biggest feature of WordPress security is malware cleaning. And let's face it, security comes to the forefront only when something goes horribly wrong. This is where WordFence is exorbitantly priced. At $490 per cleanup, on top of the annual subscription fee, is a tad bit too much to take. But the most economical option here is to install Malcare. For $99 per site per year, you get everything that WordFence offers on top of the unlimited malware removal. This is why we'll be discussing Malcare in the next section as the best alternative for WordFence. Chapter 2. Better Alternative to WordFence Premium 
After breaking down Warfriend's premium feature by feature, it has become quite obvious that Malcare is the better option. Not only is the malware scanner way better, Malcare's auto-clean feature surgically removes malware in minutes. There is no fear of breaking the site as well because Malcare's malware detection does not rely on just signature matching. It also has an intelligent algorithm. So, I'd recommend getting a free trial of Malcare by clicking on the link in description. If you still have some doubts, we've made a detailed feature-by-feature -feature comparison between Wordfence, iThemes, Sukuri, and Malcare which I will link above. Chapter number 3. Final verdict. Is Wordfence Premium worth it? Our main criteria for a strong security plugin boils down to three essential features. Malware Scanner, Malware Cleaner and WordPress Firewall. Therefore, in our opinion, Wordfence is a great option for a free plugin because the premium does not add that much value over and above the free version. In fact, Wordfence free versus paid is not even the real question to ask. It's the one-time malware cleanup fee, which is the real clincher for this decision. It is $490 over and above the annual $99 subscription fee and is guaranteed only if the admin follows all the instructions given by the Wordfence team. Once malware is on the site, and rest assured no firewall keeps out 100% of malware, Malware removal is top priority, and that's where Wordfence becomes prohibitively expensive. To conclude, I'd say this. Wordfence Free is a superb security plugin. It has all the necessary components of a WordPress security plugin, and the premium subscription is an enhancement of those features. However, if you're looking for a premium WordPress security plugin that will really protect your website, then Wordfence should not be your pick. Malcare has all the important security features of Wordfence, and it's significantly more cost effective. It will not only protect your website better, but also make it easier for you because 90% of it is automated security. That's all for today. I hope this video has been helpful. Comment below if you're stuck anywhere and I'll try my best to help you out. Do hit that like button if you found this video helpful. It really motivates us to make more such videos. That's all. This is Julian, your friendly neighborhood geek, and I will see you again next week.